just a week after President Obama's re-election, guns are flying off store shelves nationwide. And we checked here in Lexington. Local business owners tell us they have seen an increase here as well. WKYT's Brittany Paulette shows us why so many folks suddenly want to buy a gun. Here at Bud's Gun Shop, they've seen a big in gun sales, and many customers have expressed concern of new legislation. I, I think they've got a lot of stuff in the pipeline that they're working on that will probably make it a lot tougher to get them, and then I also think it'll make it a lot tougher, you know, to use them. Paul Sherwood's fear is shared by many gun supporters who have helped boost business after Election Day. It was the largest day that we've ever had. Joe Murphy, owner of Bud, says they sold over 2,000 guns that day compared to an average day where they sell 600. But Murphy doesn't think the spike in sales is all a result of President Obama getting reelected. Fear of, of the environment uh, and what's going on socially. There's more break-ins. We're seeing a lot more first-time uh, handgun owners. Gun sales increased in 2008 after Obama became president. Murphy says the spike this time around, though, is much greater, especially when it comes to assault rifles. Probably from his comment during the debate where he said that he was going to uh, look into a assault weapons ban. So I think that's probably what created the surge. Sales have returned back to normal at Bud's, but customers are paying close attention to President Obama's moves. In Lexington, Brittany Paulette's WKYT. And some gun supporters also express fear that the price of guns will go up, which is why some are buying what they can right now.